pezzi di chiesa stai mangiando? Vabbè, a che? A prugna? No, è una pesca! Eh. È troppo è dura, pesca. fa schifo, fa! Troppo dura, che buonissima, vedi che è proprio dolce dolce! Eh, vabbè, mamma mia, ma che si... Ma tu non capisci niente! Le cazzate! Ah, sì. Come erano gli spaghetti? Duri? Gli spaghetti no, erano proprio al dente! Sì, eh, al dente! Al Comunque, dente. Ah, l'ho presa la Vespa, 50 o 125! Sì, amica, la mia è meglio della Vespa! E la, eh, la tua marmitta, bravo! Va ah, boh, da! Eh. Te saluto, ciao, con qua! What does it truly mean to live like a local? In my travels around the world, I've studied and practiced this concept. And guess what? Now, I get to show you how. My name is Austin Auger. I have a background in history, a thirst for adventure. Oh, and I never need a tourist map. I'll be touring San Diego County and beyond with my buddy Adam Brick. Follow us for the next 30 days, and we'll show you exactly how the locals eat, drink, and live the good life here in San Diego, California. The fragrant spring breeze always takes me back to those midday strolls on the Ponte Vecchio in Florence. Sipping a glass of Chianti and the smell of fresh basil and garlic in the air. I was always treated like family while I was there, and if my time studying in Italy taught me anything, it's that life there revolves around the kitchen. What better way to cure my mouth-watering nostalgia than to get a taste of authentic Italian flavor in my own backyard? We popped into Mona Lisa's for a look around. They were still prepping for the daytime rush, so we decided to head down the street to visit our buon amico Danny Di Felipe, general manager at Felipe's Pizza Garden. My grandparents, when they came to San Diego, they started a little grocery store out front in 1950, and they called it Cash and Carry Italian Foods, Filippi's, and then as time went on, they had one table, two tables, three tables, and expanded from there. My grandparents would fill the order for the fishing fleet, the bread, the salamis, to take out. And that's how it grew from that. It's old style family dining. It's like what grandma makes. It. So it's that type. It's large proportions, giant meatballs, big pasta orders, and that's, and that's how we base everything on, it's just family dining. We get movie stars, hey. local people, oh. politicians. That's how we do. All walks of life coming here. Forget about it. When in Rome, you should definitely eat like the Romans do. That's exactly what we do here in Little Italy, San Diego. And when you're finished, you can get lost in some fantastic art. Or join some locals for a game of bocce. Wrapping up Little Italy, it was an awesome day. Good food, good people. We're here at the Miche Park, and we're here with some of the locals, playing some bocce. You wanna say goodbye, Adam? I guess not. We thank everyone here for the warm family hospitality and look forward to coming back very soon. Now, we change gears for some R&R &R in San Diego's Balboa Park followed up by some good eats and great times in Hillcrest and North Park. Come back for more of What's Local San Diego. Until then, arrivederci. It's all good, it's all good.